heart goes out to Riley Elliott. Yeah, I wish that people who order Uber Eats or DoorDash understood what it's like to be a driver. Like, I just spent 45 minutes on a delivery and had to pay $3 to bring this person their food because there was no parking, no free parking anywhere near their building and they refused to come out and meet me. They tipped me $1.50 and Uber paid me $2.50. $1.50 like, plus two fifty. I got approved three times the rent for income in two weeks and I can't and it doesn't matter that I'm working multiple jobs it doesn't matter that I barely sleep and can barely afford to feed myself I'm about to be homeless for the third time since May and it's all because people don't trip tip their delivery drivers like how hard is it to throw us five bucks So that was his first uh, TikTok video, which went viral. He then did a follow-up one, um, which I'm going to play right now. Um, TikTok is an extremely powerful platform. The outpouring of love and support uh, for this gentleman was huge. And um, the message here is to Uber Eats and to all those platforms that are stiffing stiffing the driver during the pandemic. They should watch this. Shame on them. And the public needs to know how these CEOs are treating individuals like Riley. Now, he follows up. He says, so I just want to take back one thing that I said in, in my video that blew up. I don't think you should take this back. I think you should let the video stand alone and then, okay, it's just my opinion. I think the video speaks for itself. Uh, I just want to take back one thing that I said in my video that blew up. Um, it's not entirely the fault of people who, who don't tip. Um, it is absolutely these companies like DoorDash and Uber who don't pay their drivers very much, who charge these extreme delivery fees and pay their dollar their drivers two dollars um we do however live in a, a society in america where it is expected that most of a service worker's income is based on their tips we usually make minimum wage or less because companies expect customers to tip. And this is one thing that has to change. Um, and it has to change. And we will change it for those companies. We will make sure that they hear us loud and clear. Um, this, obviously, if, you know, the, the Uber team, the Lyft executive team, they know about this video. And um, it puts the spotlight on their crap performance, their poor pay, and the inability to support the people who wheelbarrow the money in, right? So we got to get this viral. Help me get this viral. Um, it's a heartbreaking message indeed. Uh, first, he says, you know, he puts the blame on the tippers. The, the tippers can step up. The public can step up. Now that you know uh, what we are doing now that you know what we are getting paid, you can step up, right? A dollar is not enough, folks. We doing this essential lifting, this heavy lifting for you during the pandemic is right on that. And then the second video should be on top of people tipping poorly, right? The companies need to pull up their socks and look at how they are mistreating drivers. This is not all about the investors, right? You've put this guy... You've made this guy homeless three times. Now, my own, my only um, suggestion to Riley is, look, you enjoy doing your job, right? But you can see it's not paying you. You can see it is not paying the rent. Move on. Try out Amazon Flex. Sign up for Alto. Look at alternative, alternatives, right? Um, these food delivery, there's no money there. 
right? There's no money there. And what we need to do, like these 26,000 door dashes, we need to work together, right? Okay, staying six feet apart, just a little bit of humor here, but we need to work together and drive those prices up, Riley. We cannot accept these little onesies and twosies. We don't haul for four, right? At five, we might drive. But please, folks in the delivery business, start working together. Grubhub drivers, DoorDash drivers, Uber Eats drivers, drive the pay up. Do not, I repeat, do not take those onesies and twosies, right? Because the tip that you're going to get on that is going to be pathetic. Let them start upping the price that they pay you to be an essential worker during the pandemic times. I don't think I could make it any clearer. Um, very quick shout out to Kova. Um, if any of these companies uh, deactivate you um, while you're doing your gig job because of a wrongful report or because of something that went wrong, you need to get yourself a gig protection plan. And I offer you one free month below. So just check it out. Just try it out for a month. These packages start at $7 a month. Pay time off, sick leave, 24-7 health service, legal protection, automatic mileage tracking, and so much more. Riley, keep your head up. We support you. The TikTok community supports you. We're sending you a ton of love, brother. And um, I'm sure that um, people will help you get through that difficult phase. And thank you for being vulnerable. Thank you for sharing. And thank you for exposing these rotten scoundrels that work at the gig companies. Thank you.